guys, update. I am going to my P.O. box. Yeah, I got two mails in my mailbox. We're gonna go ahead and unbox. I'm gonna go ahead and start off with this one from Liquid IV. It says return to paradise. And I feel like it always spoils me. I'm so grateful, but this is what the package looks like. It says Pina Colada is back forever. The sun is out and summer's most iconic trick is here to stay. Pina Colada hydration multiplier is powered by CTT to hydrate you faster and more efficiently than water alone. Now I can use this with Ralph when we go play tennis. We got this Sun Bum Moisturizing Sunscreen Lotion, the Pina Colada. What is this? Oh my gosh, is this a little pouch? Okay, let's see. Oh my god, even a sticker. Look at this, the sticker they gave, guys. But let's look at this. Ooh, a little tote bag and this tumbler. Thank you so much, Liquid IV. You guys stay spoiling me. I'm really, 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 really grateful. And I'm definitely going to be using all of these. This one is from Amazon. I placed a couple of orders in Amazon because I need to fill that void. <laughs> Um, so the first one I have are these Rael beauty patches. I ran out of the PR that they sent me and these are the only patches that have worked so far. These are the little circle ones and it comes with two sizes. Honestly guys, every time I use um, pimple patches on my pimples, the next day they're gone. Maybe not gone, but like they've definitely like kind of dried out already. I also picked up the spot control cover and this one is surface hot spots. So this patch right here is what I would use on pimples that are really like stingy. They're like gross, like you see the pus. I would put this on and the next day, they're gone. Like this one right here was really stubborn and it had the pus and the next day, this one is an item that I found off TikTok. I think her name is Brooklyn, or I think it's Brooke, I could be wrong, but she does a ton of Amazon um, packages, like unboxing Amazon packages. And one of the things that she unboxed is this car um, organizer, and I think you hook it on the seat, like the second row. And I really wanted to get this because I have like little containers or like little boxes at the back of my car right now and sometimes when i'm like at costco and i have to put in water i feel like i'm not using the whole thing because i have so much bulky shit on the back of my car so i picked this one up and i'm gonna be organizing my car and i was like you know what it's something that i'm always gonna be using so the next item i have is this one piece swimmer this is like an active wear swimwear like if you're a swimmer this is probably something you would use um i would totally use my shein bikinis but girly we are swimming oh i don't know if i told you guys but i want to start swimming at my local gym because swimming works out a lot of your muscles and ralph and i were like you know what we should start swimming so i needed like an active wear swimwear that is modest enough and like not have my tits out for those old creepy men to like look at so i got this i was gonna get one from speedo but it was like 70 dollars i'm like okay i'm not trying to be i'm not trying to compete in swimming here like it's not that serious so i just got that off amazon and had a lot of reviews so i'll keep you guys updated but i just got the navy blue one i wanted to get the red one or the black one but they were not in stock, unfortunately. Next one I have is this little teeny tiny thing from Every Jewels. And funny enough, they actually emailed me back in January. And I'm only responding now. Here we go. Here's our little business card. Get groovy. Super cute. And I'm guessing they just sent a ton of rings. I think the only jewelry that I really wear are necklaces, earrings, and rings. I don't wear a ton of bracelets because I, I, my, my wrists are abnormally super tiny. And I know that this is through genetics because my mom has the same. So this one says B-I-T-C-H and it's like a flame. Um, is it a flame or is it like an angel wing? Was I like backwards? But this is what it looks like. And then I got a couple of these like rainbow rings. These are so in right now. 
Right there. Hopefully these are my size. These are size five. Okay, please. Ooh! <gasps> I'm happy. Okay, I have to remember that my ring size is size five. I thought it was size six for a second. But I think that's because my favorite number is six in general. So, these are not going to fall, right? Yeah. So, there's two of them. We have a couple more. Let me show you. I'll just go ahead and wear everything. Oh my god, this is funny. This one says rich bitch. Haha. <laughs> Same. So these are the new rings I got. I have this one that says rich bitch super super cute We got this green one. Love it fits perfectly We got a blue one and then this like gold chain next one I have is from Kulani Kini's Ooh, I'm liking this lime color Ooh, <laughs> Guys my goal is to keep my summer feed for as long as I can. I found this bikini brand, right? And it's based in the Philippines. And I was like looking at their page. They have like really, really cute stuff. But one thing that I noticed was that this bikini brand is based in the Philippines. And number two, it is managed by some Filipinos, I think. And I was like looking at their page. I was expecting to see at least like... A couple Filipinos like full Filipinos not like the half Filipino and half white type of girls to be on their page but it's all it's all just white and I'm not hating on the girls that are posted on their feed but I think this one is just more of a a problem with the brand itself because it's like how are you based in the Philippines and also have your business managed by filipinos and not have a single a single morena like brown kayomangi filipino represent your brand next one i have is this denim print bikini super cute it's not a denim material it's like still a bikini material but it just has like this denim look to it super super fun again your triangle bikini blue one and then the bottom one is another Brazilian cheeky bottom. And then I got a package from Truff or a truffle. I think these are sauces. And oh my gosh, they sent so many. We got hotter sauce, hot sauce. Which one is this? I don't know which one this is. Guys, these are all these sauces they sent. We got the black truffle infused hot sauce we got pasta sauce black truffle pomodoro we also have the spicy mayo it's also black truffle infused we got just a regular mayo this is truffle oil and we have another pasta sauce i don't know these are the little star from that'll dissolve if you run them in water so i want to go ahead and test it out Dissolve in water. Before I forget, they also sent this other hot sauce, and this one is white truffle infused. The rest are black truffle infused. <laughs> If you have been watching my vlog since 2020, 2019 to 2020, you might recognize the background, maybe. I don't know if the lighting is like washing it away, but today I am back at Hot Pilates. If you guys have been a subscriber for a while, you know that I did Hot Pilates almost every single day. I took the 7 a.m. class. It's one of those things that really just 
put me in a great place mentally and also physically and obviously since the pandemic they had to close down so i haven't been in a while and this weekend i decided to book a class a 10 30 class with lauren i've never heard of this instructor before i think she's new i'm excited i am kind of scared because hot pilates um you do pilates in a 95 degree room and it's been super fucking hot in the past couple of days and you know like I, I don't know I'm kind of scared um I've been going to the gym every day so I think my cardio so I think I'm gonna be okay because I do a lot of cardio and just like lifting weights in general this is the fit right now I forgot my group socks but here we go hot pilates <laughs> just got home from a long day of errands sorry i did not bring my camera at all just because it is still out of commission i just taped the bottom so the sd card can you know stay there but i wanted to show you guys this little massager that i got this is not a sponsored video i literally purchased this with my own money from amazon and the brand is by lunix and they come in this little pouch and I have been editing videos for as long as I can remember and this is a cordless hand massager because for the past couple of weeks, maybe even a month now, my wrists and fingers have been hurting really really bad. It's probably from editing because that's really the only activity that I continuously do for hours and hours and hours. Maybe it's also from like lifting weights because my wrist is not that used to it yet but i think it's from editing i mean i've been editing videos since 2014 since i basically started my channel so it's been a while it's 2021 and i'm pretty sure like my hand is just kind of going through it so i found this on amazon i went on a deep dive to find this thing i was like okay i need to find a massager to just specifically like massage this area here aka my palm my wrist and then my fingers because i use i'm on the computer every freaking day okay every freaking day whether it be school work and youtube i am on my computer every single day i'm also using my fingers to scroll on instagram on tiktok on twitter texting whatever it may be i'm constantly you know utilizing my fingers and i tried this last night and it feels so good you guys it feels so good at first i was like okay this is kind of weird because the setting was on um intensity five and it starts off with one being the lowest setting and then six the highest setting and there's also like different programs and it just massages your hand you can literally like watch a tv show you can read a book do anything and it like massages your hand so after one set is done you can switch it to the other hand and i have been loving it i honestly see a difference it's a lot better than my wrist brace but yeah i like to do this at night right before i go to sleep because i am usually just reading or on my phone <laughs> scrolling or i'm watching a tv show and i just kind of like let it run you know and after 15 minutes you'll see like little dimples on your hand from like the massaging but don't worry don't freak out you're gonna be okay but if you do have trichophobia you might not like the look of that but it'll be gone in like 15 minutes to put on it but yeah so i've been using this and i feel like for anyone out there who's always on the computer or you just like need a really good hand massage after like a work day a long work day this is a good investment um and yeah could not recommend this enough don't let the street lights hit you all alone 